Conductor extraordinaire Jeff Tyzik from the Rochester Philharmonic Orchestra is back with us. Good to see you. Welcome. So great to see you. How are you doing today? Real pleasure to have All you right. in the studio as always. Gala Holiday Pops coming up this weekend, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Right. Uh, this is a Rochester tradition. It's a holiday tradition, really. What's on tap with this year's show? Well, for the first time ever, uh, there was such a reaction, a positive reaction to our soloist last year, which was the incredible Don Potter. Mm -hmm. I, the next week I said, I've got to just invite him back. So Don Potter is going to come back this year. And, of course, our Festival High School Chorale, which has been a tradition for 26 years. Mm -hmm. We've got about 200 children uh, who are from 37 different high schools in our seven county area. So they all come together, about six or seven kids from each school, and we have a blast all week. There are two rehearsals, and then they sing to the filled houses in six performances. And it's one of the most in incredible things of the year. I think it's, it's in my whole time with the RPO, if I were to look back and somebody said, put a, put a finger on one thing, I would say having that choir was probably the best idea I had. Think about how many lives you've touched through the years through bringing those uh, youngsters together to be a part of this. It's amazing. You know, I still run into some of them. This one young woman, uh, Jaya, works at, at the airport, so I always see her as I'm flying out of yeah. town. She was in the very first one 26 years ago. Amazing. And we had the Naval Academy Glee Club a, a couple weeks ago, these fine young men and women who are serving our country, and, and the, the guy who was the president of the, the, the Glee Club had been in our 214 uh, high school festival corral. So it, it's always fun to run into them. It's yeah. amazing. Yeah. All right, let's talk a little bit about the music. What will we hear? Well, you're going to hear, of course, favorites like uh, Sleigh Ride and Oh Holy Night and uh, I'll Be Home for Christmas and, and the famous Christmas song. And Don Potter has some original pieces also in the second half that he'll be singing with the choir. From your standpoint, as you think about this performance, all the multitude of things you work on throughout the year, what stands out about this uh, from a professional standpoint? And from the response that you get in our community every year to this? Well, it, it's, it's meaningful. It's very meaningful to people. The, the music is joyful, but it's also spiritual. Uh, it's a chance to come and see these incredible young people. You know, they're the best of the best. Usually music students are the ones that get the highest grades, the ones that go on and succeed, because the arts really give something to them that they don't get in other ways. You know, I expected my own daughter to do well in math or in history or social studies or English, but when she was in the school play or singing in the choir, that's when I saw this humanity come forth. Mm -hmm. So the, these kids just back there singing, their spirit, they, they just, it's infectious, you know, it's an incredible experience every single year. And I finish the year thinking, you know, I'm, I'm happy to be alive to witness this. That's mm -hmm. how I feel. Well, good luck with it again this year. You know the Great. entire community is looking forward. Always good to be with you, Jeff. You too. Thanks. All right, so here's your opportunity to get tickets. Uh, call 454-2100 or online at rpo.org or just swing by the box office as well. If you missed any of that, we'll share it online as always at rochesterfirst.com.